we have sit on the couch, you're the first guy. I'm so excited about that. The most manliest man there is to have I on the couch. Have. I hope, and I want you to tell every other guy that, you know, they've got big shoes to fill. I will. You know, I don't you bloody worry about well. that. Are yeah. you? Yeah. You know what? Mm. Yeah, look, I'm, I'm wearing little tennis shoes today. I don't know what that's about. Like, Do you never normally wear shoes? It's very Seinfeld of you. Seinfeld? No, I don't know. These are really old shoes. And um, I don't know. I maybe I might just go for a walk through two rack after this. <laughs> now, um, show and tell. Yeah. What have you got? Brought a couple of things. Great. Um, okay, so here we go. Um, so, well, well, I'm a celebrity. We can start with this. I brought my bandana oh. that I wore on every episode. That's it. Hasn't been washed. Uh. Um, <laughs> it's covered in. That's what the campsite smelled like. Um, it's, it's not too bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. I think the smells. God, it always smelled like campfire. So, like that's just oh, campfire yeah. dirt and dusty and wow what this has been through eh? what that's been through that's been that was uh they one day had to run away from elephants uh with it we, yes. we had to run away from elephants and they were going to track us through smell so that's been up an elephant's nose because oh, they had to wow. take my band on her off and give it to the elephant so he could uh know my scent did you get any cr like crushes when you're in there because you know when no one else is around people who you normally don't think are attractive you start to get attracted to um oh oddly laura dundavik this really? Is I was having this conversation with my boyfriend the other day. Yeah, I found her so beautiful, and we used to cuddle. Like she was, I'm not a really touchy feely person, but we used to. She and I used to cuddle a lot, and um, <laughs> and um, and we used to we used to just like spoon in bed together. Miss Australia, and she was so beautiful. And my, I was just telling Jeffrey, my boyfriend, the other day, and he was like, "But do you reckon you could have gone there?" And I was like, "Do you know what? No, but <laughs> like." If there was anyone I could get close to, it would have been her. Oh, of course, out yeah, of it. Like, let's be right. honest. Isn't that funny that she would have felt safe with you thinking, there is nothing here, but for split seconds you were sometimes thinking, could I? There was a split I? second where we were cuddling and I was like, this would be like if, you know, if I had a girlfriend. Yeah, totally. <laughs> yeah. If I ended up dating Courtney McKean from grade nine, who I kissed at a party. Did she? Yeah. She's welcome. Really? Yeah. Mm. Okay. okay, next. Next, I have this ring. This was, I gave this to a guy. <laughs> I think it's a really cute <laughs> ring. I gave it to a guy that I was dating many, many years ago. And when we broke up, we Did stopped seeing each you? other. I said, I want the ring back. Did you? Because I really liked it and I was always really jealous that I gave it to him. So did you buy it specifically for him? I bought specifically? it specifically for him, but I always really liked it. And then you asked for it back. So then I asked for it back. So now it's my ring that I wear on stage in every gig. I always have to oh, wear something. Really? It's like this weird thing. I, have, I always have to wear something on my left hand, either a watch or a ring. It's always on my ring. Um, when oh, I'm you're really it's superstitious. Weird, yeah, that's just my one little thing. So it's always that's that ring in anything you see me on. It's always present on my left hand. Wow. Yeah, How did it go when you said, give it back? He knew he was in the shit, so. So this is always, anytime anyone sees you perform, they know yeah. the, the story behind this. Yeah, there you go, yeah. Great. Bloody, bloody Tom. Was it Tom? It's, it's, what an yeah, asshole. Tom, yeah, I know. He's moved to Byron Bay now. So oh, matter. has he? Yeah. Okay, cute. Next. And then, um, finally, I brought this. This is my best friend, Ashley, that I was oh. telling you about. Um, that's on my oh, bedside table. Oh, my God. Is that you? Yeah, that's in grade 12. Um, at our school ball, we took each other to us. We, she went to my sister's school. And, um, yeah, it we, doesn't really even look like really? you. Really? I was a little bit chubby chub there. You are a bit chubby, yeah? Mm. You're very cute. And your hair is really dark. Is that your real hair colour now? This is my real hair colour now. Yeah, it was darker, wasn't it? It's a little product, that's why. Really? Here as well. You're a beauty. And that's Ashley. That's Ashley. So, she, yeah, we met when, when we were in grade, pre, pre primary, and neighbours, and we've lived together at times. We've travelled around the world. She's like tour manager. That's like, I like hearing when people have long old friendships. Oh, yeah, you she know? Knows everything about me. She's amazing. We're in Adelaide. Saturday night together doing a show and yeah. And how much fun that you're bringing along, her along on oh, your ride yeah. too. Oh she's so cool, she's so smart, so funny, much funnier than I am. Really? Um, yeah. That was very Letterman of you. Did you watch the end of Letterman's show the other yeah. night? And he just was saying how everyone else is way funnier than him. Oh right, well I don't agree, most people aren't funnier than me. But. <laughs> 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 I love yeah, she's it. She's great. She's uh, yeah. She's a really cool person. Great. That's she's, unreal. She um she I feel also she also weirdly I think taught me a lot as well. She was the first person I ever heard swear. Oh really? Yeah. In grade four. When we were in grade like, four is the first yeah. time you heard somebody swear. Well, I, I kind of heard it before, but from like someone my age, and I was like, oh my god, we've been allowed to swear. She was so rock. She liberated you. Yeah. She was like, well, she was the cross country champion. She was always so cool. <laughs> yeah. She's one of those effortlessly cool people. <laughs>